What's up, guys? This is your boy Flexington Curry, and we back again with some more breaking hip hop news. All right, so um, if you guys been watching, you know I'm putting out, you know, videos or what I think about, you know, the Summer Impact event, Smacks URL Summer Impact event, and in that event, it was an altercation that took place between Murder Mook. And Briz Rothstein. So, 15 minutes of fame. Shout out 15 minutes of fame. I've been watching him for a minute, you know. Um, I'm an avid listener of him. You know, he's putting out these interviews and giving everybody's take on the situation that happened. Where it became a fight, a brawl, a quarrel, if you must. So, finally... Murder Mook gives an interview with 15 Minutes of Fame Radio. Now, you know what I mean? We gonna have a little clip or something for y'all. A little clip or something for y'all. But I'm going to get my take on it. So, the main thing was Briz went in on his mom. But what Murder Mook is saying in this interview or this clip that I must let y'all hear is that you know what I mean? Of course, that's not gonna go. That's you know what I mean. That's foul. Like it's battle rap, but you know what I'm saying. If y'all remember, uh, Goods had just gotten into an altercation. I'm not gonna speak too much on that altercation, but Goods had an altercation where someone spoke upon his family, and you know, and he had to take it there or whatever. And what happened in the summer? The Summer Impact Reloaded event was. He said it. Well, they said it. And then said it again. But you know what I'm saying. Like, happen. You get a chance to actually perform. Now, walk me through what's going on once you, act, you guys actually got your turn to rap. Well, before that, actually, we want to start when they started, when the battle started. Let's talk about that. Okay, well, what you want to know? Well, first off, uh, the big issue a lot of people are bringing up also is that they spoke on your moms. Yeah. Um, I, and, and I knew your moms passed, uh, how long, two and a half months, two months, yeah, three months? Yeah, yeah. So, and my condolences again Thank for you. that. Thank you. Um, when they did that, where's your mind at? I mean, at that point... Everything went out the window, like everything. You know what I mean? Like, you know, I, I just, you know, I have, I have to, I know, you know, they know, you know, my mom's passed away. You know what I mean? And I know the fact that he said it that way, you know, and the crowd reacted that way. Cause normally, you know, if you if you just say that, if you say that line to somebody else. Like, like, that's not even a line to say. You know what I mean? Like, you say that, it's like, you know, your mom's is a bitch. You know, that's like, huh? You know what I mean? That's that's for anybody else. But, you know, the reason it hit is because everybody knows that. So, when it's, when it's said, when, when that was said to me, you know, I was just anger. A lot of anger. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, I would I, I could I could have really lost it at that point. I, like I, it took a lot for me, like a whole lot, whole entire lot for me to not react to that at that point, you know. And and then and then and then they brought it back, you know, said it again. And then you know I see people on his side, like you know, like say that again and bring it back, like cheering for that line. I would never, you know, I, as far as, this is battle rap, we know. We know you got to have tough skin in battle rap. That's part of the, it's part of the, the sport. But, um, you know, and I can understand, like, if my mom's was alive, you know, if, you know, things like that, you know, that's cool. I'm cool with that. Like, you know, you cool. You say, we say all type of shit, you know what I mean? But there's a point. <clears throat> Alright, so 
I know from that little clip y'all hear. Now, me being a, a you know, a music head of, of sorts, you know, I listen to a lot of music and I've seen what's, what, what happens or what goes on in music. You know what I'm saying? And basically, he's saying if his mom was alive, all right, say that. Say that if she's alive. You know what I mean? I can defend her. If she's alive, he still can defend her. But she can defend herself also. You know, she's alive, healthy. I didn't go through trials and tribulation and turmoils. You know what I'm saying? The tears. Basically, you can equate that to, you can equate what he's saying to how, you know, Chicago and a lot of, a lot of rappers out of Chicago have got into, you know, situations or altercations because they spoke on the dead. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? They spoke on the dead or, you know what I mean? Family members that have been lost, you know, brothers, sisters, uncles, cousins, moms, fathers, you know. So you, I can equate that to that, and it's it's really sort of a similar situation, if not the same situation. But let me know what you guys think. Make sure you comment, like, share, hit that subscribe button. It's your boy Flexington Curry, and I'm out.